I've been playing Warzone Mobile since their first exclusive release, and with Global Launch right around the corner, I want to make sure that you're ahead of the game. Because I know many people out there who get slammed over and over again by players who started earlier than them. And I can confidently say this because I myself was one of those people. Oh my days, no, not like this, not like this, not like this. But don't worry, in this video, I will teach you the basic mechanics of movement and how you can use them all together to break your enemy's ankles. First one on the list, we have YYing. YYing is a technique you often see players do when doing movement. It's basically just spamming your switch buttons to look flashy, but it actually has two primary purposes that contribute to your fluid gameplay. The first purpose is to cancel reload animations, whether it's to react to an unexpected gunfight or to finish off our reload faster. Look at how fast the reload time is compared to when I don't YY. With this, you always want to be ready at all times. As for the second purpose, you can use it to cancel weapon swap animations, especially when you're in need of picking up a weapon off the ground. Next up on the list, we have slide canceling. To do this, you get into a tactical sprint, you tap crouch to get into a slide, and then you tap jump to cancel. What makes this movement technique so effective is how you can control the length of your slide. This makes you harder to hit because you can change the momentum of your movement. Number 3. Snaking. Snaking is when you continuously prone behind cover. Doing this allows you to maintain eyes on an area while never showing enough of yourself to be killed. To learn snaking, all you have to do is pull your joystick in a forward and backward motion while tapping the prone button at the same time. For comparison, look at my POV compared to my opponent's POV. What makes sneaking so OP is the fact that you have constant peekers advantage. On the bright side, majority of the player base uses this more for information rather than gunfights. Shouldering. Shouldering is basically just you popping in and out of cover to get the tiny window of information towards where your enemies are at or to know what they're doing. To do this, just roll your joystick in a circular motion repetitive. This is best used when plating up so you're not a sitting duck when your plates are cracked. With this information in your hands, how about you hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Jump shotting. It's self-explanatory, you basically jump while you're in a gunfight. This is effective because when you're jumping, your enemies are much more likely to hit your legs rather than your upper body. As for you, you're able to land shots on the upper body and maybe even a few headshots. This is great to do in a close gunfight situation where you don't have much room to work with. And you can pair this with spam jumping as well, so you're never an easy target all throughout. Now that you know all these movement mechanics, all you need now is to pre-register Warzone Mobile, available in your Google Play Store and App Store, and I guess I'll see you guys this March 21st. If you guys want to watch me play Warzone Mobile more in the future, check out my second channel in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching today's video, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.